I'm gonna go in depth on tropical depression number eight, everything you need to know about this feature. It's in the central Gulf of Mexico this morning. It's still below tropical storm for strength, 30 mile per hour sustained winds about 425 miles away from the Texas Gulf Coast. It is moving west to northwest at nine miles per hour. So it's moving in the direction uh, of Texas and it'll continue to do that. There's not really a whole lot of wind shear between our coastline and where this disturbance is. So uh, it is going to develop a little bit as it makes its way uh, toward the central Texas Gulf Coast where tropical storm watches are already up and will kick in on Friday night lasting into Saturday. This is forecast uh, to gain tropical storm force strength, but just marginally so. It would be Hannah if that happens as it makes landfall sometime late Saturday morning into Saturday afternoon uh, in the central Texas Gulf Coast, then moves inland, weakens back to a depression uh, as it works into Mexico early next week. The spaghetti plot on this uh, is a little bit more, I think, uh, insightful as far as where this is going to be heading. Uh, it's a little narrower than the forecast cone. And I would say between Baffin Bay and Matagorda Bay, uh, right in where this grouping of forecast models is, that's going to be the most likely area that the center of whatever this is, a tropical depression or tropical storm Hannah, uh, will move in. And given that location, uh, the tropical storm force wind probabilities are not very high. Again, this is barely going to reach tropical storm force strength, so 40 to 50 mile per hour winds if it can get there. So it's only going to be a 20 to 30 percent chance that a lot of the Texas Gulf Coast gets those tropical storm forced winds. Nonetheless, a tropical storm watch is up and in effect from Houston down to the valley, and that's going to go into effect starting Friday night and last into Saturday as tropical storm force winds will be possible up and down the Texas Gulf Coast. Again, this system is still in the central Gulf of Mexico. It is going to work in either as a tropical depression or tropical storm on Saturday. It looks like late morning or early afternoon. The number one threat, in my opinion, though, is going to be uh, the flooding heavy rains that are going to be accompanied with this system as it works in. Saturday is going to be the rainiest and windiest day, and we'll keep that scattered rain chance around on Sunday as that system moves inland. Yesterday, some of the weather guidance was really blowing up the rain chances and rain totals. Others, not so much. Today, we've got kind of a blend of that, and I think this is a good number uh, to go with moving forward between four and six inches of rain throughout a lot of the coastal bend and up near the Houston area, less down near the valley, less up near San Antonio, but uh, up to a half a foot of rain will be possible between Friday and Monday with the most of that rain falling on Saturday. That's going to be the most active day. So here's what to expect with what is right now tropical depression number eight. It's forecast to move in as of this morning as a tropical storm, which would be Hannah on Saturday morning or early Saturday afternoon. And this will be near the central Texas Gulf Coast. So San Antonio Bay, Matagorda Bay. And again, I want to reinforce that tropical storm force uh, the winds would be 40 to 50 miles per hour, so I don't think boarding up the homes is something that needs to be done at this point. Uh, the rainfall, four to six inches of rain, locally higher amounts will be possible, meaning localized flooding uh, will also be possible. And then at the beach, larger waves, higher tides, some coastal flooding, water up to the dunes and spots with a high risk for rip currents this weekend. Probably not the best idea to be out at the beach. 78 and calm right now, a southeast wind at five miles per hour. Today, we're gonna top out in the middle 90s. Heat index values between 105 and 110. A stray shower possible, uh, but not very likely here today. An east to southeast wind, 10 to 15 miles per hour. Partly cloudy, calm and humid tonight, 77. Rain chances increase Friday with scattered showers moving in from the Gulf of Mexico. The windiest and rainiest day will be Saturday with numerous tropical downpours as either Tropical Depression 8 or Tropical Storm Hannah works into the central Texas Gulf Coast keeping scattered showers in place here on Sunday before tapering it off gradually early next week.